back to another video. This weekend we are going to Dirtledore for round two. If you haven't seen the first Dirtledore video, go and watch that now. But yeah, this weekend we've got some pretty special jumps planned. Joined by Hattie, Charles and Ed in the back, and obviously we've got Evie just down here as our little mascot. Uh, we've got three hours left of the drive, so we'll see you there. just arrived at a spot called Dancing Ledge. Uh, we're not going to Dirtle Door yet. We've come to another spot to warm up, have a little play, just have some fun, chill out. And then we're gonna be camping tonight, same place we camped at last time. Um, and then we're gonna hit Dirtle Door in the morning. So yeah, fingers crossed the weather hides out for us because the sun's just come out and it's beautiful here. Just found the spot for the afternoon. It's a few different heights, about 50, 30, and a 20, something like that. Um, yeah, but we've got Jack. I've never actually met him before, but he's gonna do the honors and get in and depth check. So, good first impressions. Let's do this. Well, that didn't go quite to plan. I hit the bottom really hard. So it wasn't as deep as we thought, but I'm fine. It didn't hurt, but I just felt the impact. But it's all right, got wet. Had a little practice jump ready for tomorrow. I'm not sure if we're gonna jump anymore. There's a few lower spots here and the sun's shining now. It's really not that cold. So yeah, we'll see. I'm not sure what we'll do next. <laughs> We just dried off and uh, started leaving the spot. Found a good spot for bouldering, so yeah, we're just gonna sesh this wall for a bit. Jake was an absolute nutter and decides that he wants to dive head first 20 foot after everyone else was dry but he hit his back on a rock so that wasn't ideal. Um, we're all going to leave before we break ourselves and uh, go and find camp before it gets dark. We just woke up and got out of the tents, check out our camp for the night. Pretty good one, it wasn't too cold. Sheltered from the wind as well. But yeah, it's time to get up, pack everything away, and then we're gonna head to Dirtledore. I don't really know how I'm feeling about it at the moment. Been really nervous the last few days, but not feeling too bad right now. So yeah, fingers crossed. I'll feel good when we get there. So we've just arrived at Dirtledore, and we've come over the hill and spotted the arch for the first time. The nerves are settling in now. Starting to get butterflies, but it's only natural. It is pretty windy, a lot more windy than last time, which just makes me more nervous. But yeah, we'll see when we get down to the beach. The 
weather's looking so good. I'm super happy with it. I'm excited. The tide is pretty flat, no waves. Sun's out. Look at it. But once again, same as last time, now I'm here. I'm like, yeah, it doesn't look that big. But obviously I know it's it's big. It's the biggest jump that I've done. So I need to keep the composure and don't get cocky with it. And then yeah, I'm gonna suit up now and then just go send it. Oh, we're all ready to go now. And I'm just running around the cliffs trying to warm up because my wetsuit's wet from yesterday. So it's really cold, but it's all good. I'm looking forward to it. Uh, we've got a lot of filmers in today. We've got an FPV drone pilot, so it's gonna take a bit of organizing. We're gonna organize all the uh, filmers and videographers and so on now. And then we're gonna go up and jump. Woo, let's get it. this time hopefully you can hear me I'm looking forward to this we might be jumping tandem or maybe even three of us at the same time so let's do this just measured it it's much higher tide than last time so what did you say 78 78 foot, 78 foot. yeah it's a little bit lower which I'm not gonna lie I'm a little bit happy about <laughs> but yeah we're gonna jump now On the first jump now come up for a second with Robin and I want the full in half out with the stall I've been working on it loads recently I'll just quickly show you the progression and how I've been doing just to prove to you that we work our way up and we are professional about it but yeah we're up and ready to go now just gonna visualize it and then I'm gonna send it. Three, two, one!
Ah, oh, we just finished jumping and dried off. I feel absolutely incredible. That went so perfectly. The full in half out with the stall was the trick that I wanted to get last time we were here, but didn't do it because of the wind and the gap. And today there was still wind, the gap was still the same. It just proves what preparation and what visualization can do. I knew I had it, I went for it and stomped it. And then Robin, the crazy guy, crazy French guy did a triple pike half. Um, I'll put all the Instagrams of everyone that jumped in today. Go and follow everyone. They're all crazy. I absolutely love it. There was no kayakers today. Actually, they just turned up. They did just turn up. You can probably see them on the beach. But no one told us off. No one said anything. So, yeah, I'm happy all round. Really, really happy with that. We're just going to go on an adventure now. Go for a walk. See what we can find. Whew, I am a happy boy. one now I've met Robin he wants to come and hit 100 foot with us so I think that's something that might be happening in the near future but yeah thank you for watching the video see you on the next one oh and subscribe yeah do that definitely do that